Hello True Believers, time to do another view and this time we are reviewing another jersey and this one as you can see it's a Ronaldo jersey CR7 but not just any jersey this is a jersey that he wore when he was in his peak uh, you can almost say that it was this is where he was the most dangerous when he was the mullet Ronaldo is what we call him because he was wearing a mullet at that time so it, it's in its orig original packaging, as you can see, it's, it's got the Nike swoosh on it. So it's a company that specializes in classic jerseys. So this is something he probably wore, I think 10 years ago. So 2012, I mean, somebody in the comments will probably correct me. So let's take a look at the jersey. So you guys can, so this is when Cristiano Ronaldo was developing and he was still in Manchester United. So this is, a black Manchester United jersey. So let's unwrap it and unbox it for the first time and take a look. So here it is. Ta -da! And like I said, it's from Nike, but it's classic Nike. They have a comp Nike has a company where they they reproduce these, especially something that's popular now. Did Ronaldo wear something like this? No, because he usually wears long sleeves, which is not something that we prefer wearing. We prefer short sleeves. So there's a long sleeve version of this, which would probably be more accurate to what Ronaldo is wearing. But we were, we're not just gonna put this on a shelf and display it. We wanted to use it and it was more practical to have short sleeves. So here's what it looks like in the back. As you can see, it's got the red devil right there. And you got the classic stripe coming down in the back like this. And then Manchester United Football Club. That's what MUFC stands for. It comes all the way down and you've got the Ronaldo. This is actually our first Ronaldo jersey. We've had like other Manchester United, other Real Madrid jerseys and Juventus jerseys, but this is the first one we ever had where it actually has his name on it. And then Hero is a is that's his generation. He's a big fan of Ronaldo growing up. So I like uh, the reason why we picked this because it was simple. I uh, have these red, this kind of red stripe, red pinstripe coming down on the sleeves like this in the back. But other than that, it's pretty basic. It's pretty simple. So this, this is what I like about it. And you can wear this with black shorts and it would look awesome. So that's enough of the case. You see the little Nike swoosh on the plastic bag. Even has some plastic attention on it. But anyway, that's not important. Let's get to the front. So here is, there's the, the tissue, the ch shirt tissue that comes with it. And here it is, the AIG, the logo in front. It's as simple as it gets. When, when you see Ronaldo wearing this, he was doing, this is when he was the most amazing when, in his dribbling, in his shooting, in his, all his skills move, from Ronaldo chops to step overs. He was, this, he was developing it and perfecting it while he was wearing this kit right here, the AIG. Yes, it is. He, he wore the long sleeve version, but for our purposes, we <laughs> prefer the short sleeve. And it just, for me personally, I just don't like wearing long sleeves with shorts. It's okay if you're wearing long sleeves with long pants, like a jogging track pants, but when you're wearing shorts with this, it just looks kind of off to me. The balance is kind of off when you've got long sleeves with short shorts. So it's also a aesthetically what looks better. I, I know Ronaldo likes to wear long sleeves, not sure why, but for our purposes, since you're gonna be wearing shorts with it, I said it, it would look better if it was short sleeves. So it looks like the color is different. Like this is gray and this is black, but I think they're both black. It's just the orientation of the, the texture is 
you can see there's there's this little texturing here. You see this stripe here, another stripe here, another stripe here. And I don't think that's it has that here, so that's why it looks different. The sleeve looks different from the rest of the shirt. And here is it's a Nike dry fit in medium. And then you get the Manchester United crest on it, which is a patch. As you can see it's sewed on, so that's not going to peel off with wash. And the same thing here with the, oh, this, this is the Champions League, Barclays Champions League. Same thing over here. This is a patch also. It's supposed to be a patch. Hmm. Looks like it must must have been ironed on. There's there's no there's no stitching here in the back that says. So hopefully that doesn't peel off. Peel off. But this one, as you can see, is stitched on. Good. And same thing on the other side. So that's symmetrical. There's a patch on both sides for Barclays Premier League. So that's what the Manchester United is in. He's there in the Premier League. There's different leagues. So let's take a, keep taking a look at the rest of the shirt here. It's, uh, as you can see here, Red Devils. And it's got this embroidered Nike fit on it. And you got this. This tag over here, stay cool, dry fit, pull sweat away. So it's a pretty thin material, so it's not that heavy. So it won't soak up a lot of water or sweat and weigh you down. So that's what the trend is when, with a lot of these football shirts is they try to be as thin as possible. So the sweat won't saturate it and add another five, 10 pounds for you to carry around of water. So that is pretty much it here. You got this is embroidered also, the Nike swoosh, and you got the little red stripe over here. And this would look great with some Nike black shorts, which we have a pair actually. So just as long as it has a Nike white swoosh. I couldn't find the matching shorts with it. Anyway, they're kind of probably short shorts back then. So, this is what it looks like. So it's in medium, so Hero should fit into it just nicely. And like I said, this is his first Ronaldo shirt. So we're gonna try it on and use it for today's training. So we're gonna do our individual training. All right, enjoy the rest of the video. This is Bell Okay, hey, here it goes. It's perfect. In medium, there's a little bit of room in the sleeve over here. A little bit of room in the sleeve over here to let his arms grow a little bit, but the chest, it is perfect as you can see AIG hero is 510 165 pounds actually it's probably closer to 170 now uh, go ahead and turn for us so this is what it looks like and couple it with some plain black Nike shorts you can see the Barclays Premier League patch on the side and then go ahead and in the back Ronaldo so do the thumbs up showing look in the back like this like that so there you got the ronaldo set wait wait a second now let's appreciate let's move back a little bit let's appreciate the red stripes and uh, yeah, the number in the back and this this red stripe and towards the bottom here like I said, couple it with ni black Nike shorts and some Nike socks and you're set. Turn again on the side here. So same thing on the side. So the medium is perfect for him as you can see. And one more, because if we went with large, it would be too loose and it would have too much material. And the trend these days is for something that's, that's the more fitting. So let's take a look at the, the sleeve over here. Yeah, I'll raise it up a little bit like pull. So there's, so there. Got the stripe, the patch, swoosh, the AIG sponsor. So it's not in your face. It's just plain block letters. So it's good. Uh, what really the design is, you got the red stripe over here and you got a little accent over here on the red. See how it's just the little details. Go ahead and put your arms down. So you got the little details here, the red over here, red over here, red over here. But other than that, everything looks simple and clean. 
and classic. So this is a vintage Manchester Ronaldo shirt. We like it in short sleeves. So turn around one more time and that should complete our review of the classic Nike Ronaldo Manchester United mullet Ronaldo jersey back in the day when he was developing in Manchester United before he moved to Mad Real Madrid which is uh, 2012, 13, 14, 10 years ago. Okay, I'll see you guys in the next vlog. This is Bell Tony. Thanks for watching.